and we have the provision moving the way that we have ITAIL. Now we're working on Interpol, the International Police Organization. Again, it will increase Taiwan's international space. But there are other considerations too under the Taiwan Relations Act. And when I've gone down to Gaoshan and seen the naval base and taken my delegation on one of those submarines, it is very clear that Taiwan needs to help with the equipment, needs to help with the cooperation of the United States to have an indigenous program for diesel submarines. That is something that we need to cooperate with Taiwan on. It is also very clear, well, I, I was, we were in the air base in Taiwan. It's very clear that Taiwan needs to have 16. This last session, legislation which I passed, reasserted the importance of the Taiwan Relations Act and TRIP gave Taiwan the ability to accept delivery of four of our frigates, guided missile frigates, um, for Taiwan. Now, I can tell you that shortly the first of those frigates, uh, which is being refitted right now in San Diego, and I'm going down to see that frigate, will be headed to Taiwan on completion. And so, these are steps which we need to take and in which members of the Taiwan Caucus and members of the Congress are increasingly asserting as an important responsibility under the Taiwan Relations Act. Let me add to you one other consideration. As we try to encourage more collaboration, more investment of our companies in Taiwan, just as Taiwanese companies come here to the United States to invest. One thing that concerns me is if the Trans-Pacific Partnership goes forward, and we end up with other countries in the Pacific Rim with the ability, tariff-free, to trade with the United States and vice versa. I do not want to see a situation where Taiwan does not have a seat at the table in order to push for their interests in this negotiation. We don't want this to end up with Taiwan being locked out because we don't want uh, exports out of Kaohsiung to be at a disadvantage compared to exports uh, out of South Korea or elsewhere. This needs to be addressed. Taiwan's interests need to be at the table. This is what I'm saying. We need to have Taiwan have that seat at the table to represent their interests as we go. And so I would just share with uh, the chairwoman and uh, your delegation and our friends here in the audience, I would share with you that I think the future looks very bright for the relationship between Taiwan and the United States. I would share with you that the contributions made by Taiwanese Americans, as we just recognized this last month, have been uh, incredible. And lastly, I would share with you that the sons and daughters of the Taiwanese Americans here face a very bright future, but also look forward to their contribution in giving back to Taiwan and building further those bridges between the United States and Taiwan. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. Let me thank everybody. Help us in the train in stream is the uh, S16, the submarine, everything. But most important, he walk and ask because the Obama administration to help Taiwan to increase the international space with dignity and respect. Ladies and gentlemen, once again, once again, thank you so much.
Marissa Tillman and Marie Ivana. Thank you. 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 Thank